Hello guys, welcome to this video. In this video, our question is the horizontal distance between two towers is one forty meter. The angle of elevation of the top of the first tower, when seen from the top of the second tower, is thirty degree. If the height of the second tower is sixty meter, find the height of the first tower. So this is our question. Solve this. So first, it is given that there are two towers at a distance of one forty meter. So now in the question is given that from the top of the first tower, so the from the top of the second tower, the first tower can be seen at a degree of thirty degree. From this we can understand that the first tower is taller than the second tower. So we can draw uh, two towers like this. So this is the first, and then this is the second, and uh, the distance is given one forty meter. So this full distance is given one hundred and forty meter. So now, from the top of this tower, if we will see, the angle will be thirty degree. So this is the first tower, and this is the second tower. So second tower height is given sixty meter, and we need to find the value of the first tower from this information. So first we name it A, B, C. on d and e so now we will take the first triangle abc so in triangle abc you can write the tan 30 degree will be equals to so tan 30 degree for this angle we are taking the value of tan so tan means height by base so our height is ab and our base is bc so height by base so tan 30 value is 1 by root 3 Equals to AB by. So now, if we look at this diagram carefully, this BC value is equal to this DE. They are parallel to each other. So this BC and this DE value will be equal. So in place of BC, we can write one forty meter. So we can write AB will be equal to one forty by root three. So we keep our answer like this now. Now, if we look at a diagram uh, carefully, AB value we got that is one forty by root three. Now BD value, so BD value will be equal to this CE value. So BD value will be equal to CE value. So you write height of first tower will be equal to AB plus BD. So this portion. Plus this portion, we will get the height of the first tower. So AB value got one forty by root three, plus BD value that got sixty. So now it's simplified. So root three I take as LCM plus sixty root three. So now um, this one forty plus sixty from here we take twenty as common. But if we take twenty as common now, seven plus three root three by so this root three convert into one point seven three two. So root three we can write as one point seven three two. Now we have to divide twenty by one point seven three two. So if we divide it, we will get eleven point five four seven. So if we divide twenty by one point seven three two, we will get this value. So if we round it off, we will get eleven point five five. So now multiplied by this seven plus three root three. So so first three into root three do so three into one point seven three two get five point one nine six. So with this plus seven, so it will become twelve point one nine six. This one this one also if we round off we will get twelve point two. So with this we multiply twelve point two. So our final answer will be one forty point nine one meter. So this will be the final answer for this question. But in this question, this answer will not be much accurate. So for for making this answer accurate, we need to follow another method. So in this method, we have not calculated this one forty by root three. So if we will calculate one forty by root three in this portion only, then we will get an accurate answer like this. If we do the another method, 
we need to find the value of AB in this portion only. So 140 by 1 by 72 we have to do. So we will get 80.83. So now this 80.83 value is the value of this AB. So now height of tower means AB plus BD. So that will be 80.83 plus 60. That will cost 140.83 meter. So this answer uh, seems accurate. But if we follow this method, so both the answers will be correct. So for this question, our final answer will be 140.83 meter. So this is the final answer for this question. So guys, thanks for watching this video and please subscribe my channel for more solutions like this.